MIT engineers have developed a thread-like robot that can actively glide through narrow, winding pathways, such as the vasculature of the brain. This magnetically controlled device is a hydrogel-coated robotic thread, or guide wire, that could be used to deliver clot-reducing therapies and other treatments in response to certain brain blockages, such as stroke or aneurysms. To clear blood clots in the brain, doctors often perform a minimally invasive surgery in which a surgeon inserts a thin wire through a patient's main artery, typically in the leg or groin, then manually manipulate the wire up to the damaged brain vessel. These medical guide wires used in such procedures are passive and require surgeons specifically trained in the task. They are also made of a core of metallic alloys coated in polymer, a material that the researchers say could potentially generate friction and damage vessel linings if the wire were to get stuck in a particularly tight space. To help improve such endovascular procedures, the MIT engineers combined their work in hydrogels and magnetic actuation to produce a magnetically steerable, hydrogel-coated robotic thread, which they were able to make thin enough to guide through a life-size silicone replica of the brain's blood vessels. The core of the robotic thread is made from nickel-titanium alloy, a material that is both bendy and springy. The team then coated the wire's core in a rubbery paste, or ink, which they embedded throughout with magnetic particles. Finally, they used a chemical process they previously developed to coat and bond the magnetic covering with hydrogel, a material that does not affect the responsiveness of the underlying magnetic particles, and yet provides the wire with a smooth, friction-free, biocompatible surface. They demonstrated the robotic thread's precision and activation by using a large magnet to steer the thread through an obstacle course of small rings, reminiscent of a thread working its way through the eye of a needle. The researchers also tested the thread in a life-size silicone replica of the brain's major blood vessels, including clots and aneurysms modeled after the CT scans of an actual patient's brain. The team filled the silicone vessels with a liquid simulating the viscosity of blood, then manually manipulated a large magnet around the model to steer the robot through the vessel's winding, narrow paths. The researchers say the robotic thread can be functionalized, meaning that features can be added, for example, to deliver clot-reducing drugs or to break up blockages with laser light. Their hope is to soon leverage existing technologies to test the robotic thread in vivo.